Hey everyone. <clears throat> hey everyone. How's it going? Happy Thursday. Today was gorgeous and then the clouds, you know the rest, so yeah. So for tonight, making another poem video. This is 133. The last one was 132. And I did number 132 on, what was it? Uh, oh, yeah. One of the greatest, one of the most famous countries ever to represent the UK. And that was Wales, which I will never forget as ever. So, Wales was a very wonderful country to write a poem about. And tonight, on this poem video, 133, I've written another very wonderful country that I love very much. I remember reading about this country when I went to my grandmother's um, very old encyclopedia books. And I remember discovering this country very much, which happens to be Canada. So Canada was... I've heard a lot about Canada when I was growing up. Never knew much about it, but as I hit my teenage years, I started learning more about it as ever. And ever since then, I've been hooked on the country as always. So Canada has been my favorite country to visit, which I hope to visit someday when the time comes. So yeah, so that's what will be my favorite. Yeah, so tonight's poem video, I wrote a very good poem about my favorite country, and that is Canada as ever. So get ready as I read you this poem as I call this one, Good Times in Canada. All right, so yep, here I go. I've got the poem known as Good Times, and yeah, the name of this poem that's based that's definitely on my favorite country ever, known as Canada. So get ready. So get ready as I read this to you guys, and I hope you're watching this. So yeah, I call this poem Good Times in Canada. <clears throat> Good Times in Canada. Canada is my favorite country to be made, along with gorgeous memories from every decade. Many areas of the country, many areas of the country are fun to check out, discovering them of what they're all about. Toronto is a sweet place, which brings a smile to my face. We have Alberta as the best, adding that to my quest. Winnipeg is next on my road trip, hoping to find friendship. Ottawa is seen every year. When the sky is amazing and clear. I would love to visit a mountain as my wish. While having some wonderful Canadian dish. Canada is recognized for the wilderness. That is something I love to be blessed with. There is one last thing not to see loose. It will be a Canadian moose. All right, my friends, here is I show you the flag of Canada and the picture of the country. Yep, especially, I believe, the city of Toronto, so I'll just show you, yeah. There you go, my friends, the flag of Canada at the top and the country on the bottom, which happens to be the city of Toronto with the, I believe, the Toronto Sky Dome Tower, so yeah. Sorry about that. Yeah. So here you go, my friends. I'll show, you one, I'll show you again one last time so you guys can see. Hold on. Here we go.
Hi, my friends. All right, my friends. There you have it. That was the poem based on one of my that based on my favorite country ever, known as Canada. As the name of the poem was called "Good Times in Canada." So, I hope you guys enjoyed this. This was a very good poem to write about, and I hope you enjoyed tonight's poem video. This was one thirty-three. The last one was on Wales, so this one on one thirty-three was called. The poem was the poem was called "Good Times in Canada." I hope you guys enjoyed this. And I hope you got to enjoy this poem as I read it to you all out there. So, hope you enjoy it as ever. I just want to say thank you for your time, my friends. And I will see you the next time I can have a poem video. So, take care. Enjoy this evening. And I'll see you guys next time. Take care, my friends.